Travis. What's going on, man? Hey, man. Good Welcome to Hattie B's. Absolutely. Nice to meet you. You ready for some spice? I'm ready for it. I don't know if I'm going to be ready for it later, but I'm ready for it right now. Let's come on in, man. <laughs> That is right, you just saw this is not your average interview. Hello everybody, my name is Adam Wurzel. This is Nash Line here on the Country Line app, and this is a man who may need some after a few hot chicken tenders. This is Travis Denning. Travis, good to see you, buddy. Good to see you, brother. Why did you agree to do this? I don't know. <laughs> I'm, I, I'm, I'm scared, 100%. I'm ready for the hotness, but I don't, I like hot chicken and hot, but I, it doesn't like me. You know, that's the problem, so, but why not? Let's explain to everybody where we are. We're here at Hattie B's Hot Chicken, which is, I would say, probably the most famous hot chicken restaurant here in Nashville. It's gonna be good. I mean, it, chicken is chicken. I don't care how hot it gets. I love fried chicken. I mean, I grew up in middle Georgia, so it's a big part of my upbringing and the, and the food I love. David Ashley Parker from Powder Springs, November 27, turning 23. This has been quite the year to be Travis Denning. Within a month, you're playing Nissan Stadium in the Grand Ole Opry. When you hear that, what, what goes through your mind? I mean, it's crazy. I mean, I, what goes through my mind is all the times that I played all the small places that nobody showed up to. And just to have an opportunity now to go out there and be able to, for whatever reason, someone let me play at Nissan Stadium for CMA Fest and just get out there in front of all those people. And even though it's a small little moment, try and make the best of it and show them who I am. After a few drinks, it's always the same thing. Let's talk about After a Few. The song's all over the radio. It's a great song, and it really just honestly makes, makes me and I think everybody watching at home makes you want to drink. I mean, it's a song that, you know, I think it's a story that's been told a lot, but it's because a lot of us can relate to it at, at any given point in our lives. And that's just having a relationship with someone that no matter what you try to do to get away from it or how wrong it might feel or time to move on, whether it's a couple of drinks or a couple of texts or whatever it is, it just pulls you right back in. I want to talk about playing C2C in, in, in the UK. What was it like being in a foreign country, hearing people sing David Ashley Parker from Powder Springs back to you? Yeah, completely wild, just so insane. It, I don't even really know how to describe it. It was very surreal, very cool. And just to be me and myself with a guitar, on stage at, at the Indigo in the O2 and there'd be almost 2,000 people in there was mind-blowing. I mean, I didn't even know, it was insane. And I, I'm pumped to be able to go back in October. I cannot wait to go back. I had the time of my life. I mean, we, we left, we were there for seven days. And I thought, you know, I'd probably start to get homesick. And in some ways I was, but like, it was a bummer to leave. I mean, I really love the UK and, and I'm excited to go to Europe for the first time. I've never been to Norway and Sweden and Germany and it's just gonna be an awesome two weeks in October. Travis, are you ready to do it? No, but let's do it. <laughs> All right, Chef Brian, come on out. What's up, go. boys? How are you, Brian? Fantastic, good to see y'all again. Man, you're in for a treat. We've got you a little heat sampler here. So our chicken starts off at no heat. We didn't go all the way down there because you're here for a challenge. Yes, absolutely. So 100%. we left the southern and the mild out, Perfect. right? So we're starting at our medium right here. We got medium and hot. These are at the top end of our everyday heat levels, right? We get a lot of folks who eat these every day. They love them. They're balanced. They're, they're spicy, but they're savory and, and delicious too. These are our daredevil heat levels, our extremists only, enthusiasts only. This is damn hot, and this is shut the cluck so, up. Look at the difference just between hot and damn hot. It's the differences in the, in the color of the peppers used, yeah. you know? As we get hotter, we use different peppers, and they progress up. And it's, like you say, the darkest is actually all this habanero that appears here. But once we get into more of that ghost pepper up here, it's actually a little bit lighter in color. So it'll fool you, but not once it hits your mouth. When we try shut the cluck up, what should we expect to feel throughout our bodies? You know, it's pain, but it's good pain. It's endorphin pain. It's a, it's a high. It'll last about 20, 30 minutes, and then so you're It's like going go. for a jog That's while it. eating hot chicken. So we've got our banana pudding on each side. This is our incredible banana pudding toasted meringue. I'm going to go ahead and get a base. I'm going to go ahead and get This is good. Coat the yeah, tongue. I'll try some Smart approach. Too. Here's what I suggest, and this is just a challenge. Let's see how long we can go without the milk. Okay. There you go. He reluctantly says, okay. <laughs> All right, so medium first. I'm doing a medium first right here. All right. This is approachable. You're going to like this. This is nice and balanced. Probably our most popular heat level, right? It's a little touch of the heat. You really get the flavor of Hattie B's, the flavor of Nashville hot chicken. But it's all of that stuff, right? It's savory. It's a little yeah. sweet, a little smoky, and a little bit of heat. Not bad. Get in there, Travis. So this is the hot. This is at the top of our everyday scale, right? So here we start to introduce a little bit of habanero, a little bit of the hot stuff. It is so delicious, though. Mm. Thank you. 
That's the goal. We don't want this to be a gimmick or a tchotchke, you know. We want this to be delicious chicken. So what I'm gonna what I'm gonna continue to do is I'm doing one bite, moving on. All right, yeah. that sounds good. But I may come back to that hot because it's really delicious. All right, damn hot it is. Yes. So you're taking the big leap. Now there's a big jump here. Right. Oh great. You're you're gonna notice it. This is black, y'all. <laughs> Yeah, I'm just, I'm just going so, in. So here we start to introduce a lot of habanero to the mix. Look at that, huh. eating like a man. Now careful with those fingertips, brother. Here you go. Mm. That's a dangerous touch now. That is um, hotter fingers. than the other ones. It is hotter than the other ones. Yes, this is getting into true daredevil mode The here. thing is, when it's on your tongue, it's like, that's okay. And then mm. you swallow, and then your life is over, pretty much. <laughs> And then the more you breathe, I have a, I have a few, te I have a few tears. Yeah, just a little bit, man. The thing is, again, it's like one bite. You're like, okay, but I couldn't imagine eating that whole thing. Also, it's getting worse. Well, see, that's why we start you with the medium I and went the hot. Right in, dude. Like, what? The medium and the hot will make you brave. Yeah. The damn hot to shut the clock up will bring you back down. Yeah, I'm sorry, I'm so over it. It's, it's fine. Go for it. I need to. I'm not trying to prove that I'm some sort of champion of heat. Wow, that immediately helps. Yeah, right away. I want to, I'm going to try to But we need to, but we need to like, I'm, I need a base before I do shut the cluck up. Yeah, you might as well just go ahead and go there while I you're in supper mode. Thing. Right. You know, don't get back down to nothing and then right. bring yourself again there. All right. Now, look, for what it's worth, the hottest part is definitely sitting right there. All right, everybody. Shut the cluck up, down the hatch. See, this is that fake bravery moment right here where you feel like, yeah, I'm the man. It has a sweeter I'm taste. good. Oh, that is immediately hot. <laughs> See that? He's like, no, 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 it's sweet, it's gentle. Travis, oh God. There you it, go, banana pudding will save you. This too, highly recommended. This is our creamy bacon potato salad. It has the same effect. I like it. Nice My whole cool. head is getting bigger. Like I'm things are put, enlarging inside of me. It's fine. Trucker has Did you see another one? I'll do it. Did you see another piece of that? Yeah, I like it. He did. I think that means you've got to also do that. Is this it right here? Yeah, that's to shut the clock up. You can't let the host take you down. Jeez, oh my God. I'm, I'm not right. no way trying to take you down. He's trying to take you down. He talk, we talked about it early. This is so bad. <laughs> like, you know, it's, it's so good. bad, but it's so good. Has the, has the pudding. It's so good. You know what the pudding's made with? Milk. <laughs> so this is a little workaround. That, all right, when you do that, it helps for about thir like three seconds. <laughs> I'm fine. <laughs> Super smooth. I'm good. Cool. So t t let's talk about the uh, the rest of the year for you, Travis. All let's right. talk about what's happening next. What happens <laughs> after this hot chicken? Let's get philosophical. We'll wait. Uh, we got CMA Fest next week. Playing a lot of great festivals this summer. That's the hottest thing I've ever tasted <laughs> in my life. Oh, it burns bad in the back of the throat. Can we, get, uh, can we get a little chorus of David Ashley Parker? No, <laughs> God, no. Uh-uh. Oh, my God. Yeah, so we're just playing a lot of shows. I have a new song coming out tomorrow for the fans. Um, it's called Freeze My Charmin Before We Go Eat Hot Chicken. <laughs> it's, called Tank, it's called Tank of Gas on a radio song. Real pumped up. I'm just pumped to get more music out to people. Well, Travis, we really appreciate you being such a, such a good sport, such a hot sport. Um, can we also talk about what time it is right now? Yes, by the way. Uh, what, it's the morning. It's like before 11 o'clock in the morning, which for people in this business is very early. It's early for hot chicken. But you purposely, I didn't eat anything before I came here. I didn't either. How do you feel now? Dude, I'm like, it's, this is helping. How do you think you're going to feel around 1 p.m. today? Good. Good. I'm crying hot tears. Travis Denning everybody his song is called after a few it's an amazing song he's all over the place go to his website he's got tour dates excuse me thank you so much it's been Gee, fun. thank you yeah it's been something yeah <laughs> Woo.